What's up guys, Minecraft Dungeons has been out almost a week, the story is incredible, but how do the bosses stack up? Let's find out where every Minecraft Dungeon boss ranks. Coming in dead last we have the Enderman. Despite a scary scream and the teleportation being a bit annoying, he is easily the easiest boss in massive quotation marks and can be taken down incredibly fast. Next up we have the Evoker. Similar to the Enderman, he doesn't have a lot of health, but his traps and henchmen that he spawns are more of a challenge and were the first real enemy I died to as I was caught unaware by his moveset. Next up we have the Skeleton Horseman. While their health is still low, like the others, they make up for it in numbers and can be deadly if you're caught unaware. The first phase of the Arch Illager battle is up next. This is a very deceptive fight as it's a final boss, but this first phase is actually really easy, despite the extra enemies, and can cause you to get a bit cocky and set you up to be destroyed in the second phase. We are now moving into bosses that are not cannon fodder and can actually be pretty tricky if you aren't prepared or aren't at the right power level. Up next we've got redstone golems. While it's obvious when these golems are going to do anything, such as when they can be majorly damaged, they can do crazy damage with their attacks and their explosives can leave you worse for wear. The redstone monstrosity is a bigger version of the redstone golem, but it is also more difficult. If you can't utilize the forges around the map, the mobs that he spawns and the constant burning lava, this monstrosity can deal out incredible damage, but unfortunately it just misses out from cracking the top three. Just cracking the top three is the nameless one. The Nameless One cracks the top three for the damage it puts out combined with the constant additional enemies he spawns. Although it doesn't have the beefiest health bar, it is difficult to get to him simply due to the amount of extra enemies he spawns. Coming in second place is the Corrupted Cauldron, for one simple reason, the slimes. The Corrupted Cauldron spawns an insane amount of slimes on top of additional enemies which can cause crazy damage and the first time I encountered this boss I struggled purely due to the amount of extra enemies. Taking the number one spot is the Heart of Ender. The second phase of the Archillager, this boss is truly a boss fight. The boss's lasers do crazy damage with more lasers that adapt to how you move, combine this with a tanky health bar and it's clear why this boss takes the top spot and it's definitely a massive jump from the first phase of the fight. So that was every Minecraft Dungeon boss ranked. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe, hit the notification bell as it means a lot, and I'll catch you next time.